Hi, I'm Travis with Gazelle Tents, and I'm here today with our T4. The T4 is the perfect size for family camping of four or even four adults. This is just a great tent, and you're going to see some of the features as we take it, set it up and take it down. So the first thing we're going to do is just go ahead and get it right out of the bag. As we unzip the bag, you're going to see our tents come fully assembled and are hassle-free. So here's all the parts that are in there. You've got your rain fly. the tent stake bag, which also has your tie down lines, and then your tent. As I slide that tent out, there's no poles to mess with, there's no features that you gotta assemble, we're ready to go. So I'm gonna take off the strap, start to lay out the tent. As we unfold it, you're gonna start to see some of those walls come out. And now what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna grab this first hub and set up. I like to, as a little feature, if you step on the edge of your tent, it's gonna pop out a little bit easier for you. Work your way around. As you can see, as the sides come out, the tent starts to take that shape. Get to our last side. Now because of this design as well, once it's up, you can maneuver it around so you can put your door wherever you want it. So I'm actually going to take my tent, I'm going to slide it back, and I'm going to get that door opened up. You can see the bug net there, so you can have a lot of nice ventilation once you get it set up. So before I go in and I pop up the ceiling, what I want to do is I want to put my rain fly on. So I'm going to take that rain fly out, unfold it, and then we're going to go around and we're going to put the stakes into our corner pieces. So I'm going to go ahead and lay it out, slide it right in, work my way around. Right up into the corner. As we get these up, get to the last one, and then we're gonna be ready to raise up the ceiling of the tent. So to do that, all you do is walk inside this nice big D door. You're gonna push up on the center hub, and that ceiling is gonna lock right into place. It's gonna make your rain fly nice and tight. To help keep the rain off, you're gonna take your fly and attach to the sides all the way around. Once you get that done, now you're ready to stake out your tent. So you can take the nice thick webbing straps that we have here with the big grommets on each corner and in the center. As this tent is bigger than our T3, as you're accommodating a larger family or more adults, you're gonna to wanna to stake this out to give yourself the most room inside. Once we've got it staked out, we're ready to camp. Now you're done and you're ready to go home. The T4 goes down just as easily as it goes up. So you're just gonna do everything in reverse. I'm gonna go around and I'm gonna take off the outside part of my rain fly. Now there's two ways to take this down. You can go back inside and you can pull down on that hub. There's a rope attached to it. You can pull it down from the inside or you can just stand on the outside and hit the post and boom, your top goes down. Now once the top's down, I can go around and start to take off my rain fly. I like to leave it right on top of the tent in order to keep it nice and clean from the ground. If it's really wet, you might want to take it off, but this way I can just roll it up on both sides, pull it off, and I'm ready to now take down the rest of the tent. So we've got our fly off. We're gonna go around and we're gonna do just like we did before where we're gonna take down from the hubs. So we're gonna push in that center, working our way right around the tent. It'll start to fall on top of itself. You get to that last one, put your door inside, push down, fold it right over the top, and you can start to gather it in. And you are ready to put your strap on put it back in the bag with the rain fly and your stakes and you're ready to go on your next adventure.